Hello everyone and welcome to another Plan With Me video. This is Elise of Plan With Elise and today we are planning again in my teacher layout for the week of June 12th. Um, this layout has been really helpful for me this past week and it's something that I see myself using for a while in addition to my other planners because it's one place to kind of see everything at a glance. So with the teacher layout, I'm covering up all this <laughs> because we are going to customize, we're going to make the days of the week up top and customize these categories to make them my own. So I have planner, planner Kate stickers here, which I've been really enjoying using in this layout. Um, so this is the 431 kit. This is the weekly sampler. And I'm going to, it's a little bit short. So I think what we'll do, we could either, oh, you know what? We can put it just like right kind of here, I think. Yeah, I think that works. And then I need my slice cutter, of course, to trim that. So let's do that. And then the other thing is, I'm realizing I have my Planner Kate stickers here. I'm trying to remember that's the diff that's what I used last week. I thought I maybe had like a yellow strip or something. So I'm looking on like the side of these sticker sheets because they often have fun things to include. But I think we'll leave it with the strip, whoops, as is. Oh, there's this stripe one. Well, we could put that, we could put that somewhere else. Now I need to date this. So these stickers that I picked up, I only got these two from this, um, I think, I think I only got these two from that recent order. Yeah. Let's just check. I'm just looking at my order on the side here. I did an unboxing last week for that. So now I need dates. Let's, I have my Mojo Jojo plans, rainbow date it. This is just such an easy book to grab to get the dates in. And I think we're going to go with yellow maybe what kind of blue is in this i'm leaning towards yellow this is more of a navy blue so i think yellow is probably going to be the best option but i'm realizing i don't have the paper ones i do prefer paper over clear i think that the color just pops more with paper so we are going to use paper for these and then we'll use the clear for the days or the dates. So we'll get these down Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I don't know if I'm in the minority in terms of preferring paper stickers to clear ones. I think I just find them easier to work with, easier to cut. They are just my preference. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. All right, now. We're gonna jump to days. So let's grab from clear or the clear stickers. Definitely need the tweezers for these because I find them hard to pull off. Most clear stickers I have a hard time pulling off. It's probably because of my nails, but I also just think that the tweezers are easier for placement. So we will get through this part and then be whoops. Come on good to go. Sometimes when I use the tweezers too much, my hand gets sore, which it's starting to right now. I think it's also, see, I ripped that. I think it's also because I've been using my hands and wrists so much with packing. Um, that, that's that been, uh, been a thing. Also, I know that this video is going up normally at the time that my big plan with me is going up. My YouTube schedule is going to be a little wonky this week. So um, you may see videos at different times of day, but we're, we should be back on track next week. This week, I think, is just going to be a little different. So hopefully you can stick around as, as we work to <laughs> deal with this massive change in my life. Okay, so we are going to see the flowers through these stickers 
Um, but as I write on them, I think it's going to be less obvious. So it's not really bugging me as it normally does. I wanted that to go a little bit higher. Planner Kate stickers peel off really, really nicely. I wish that the days of the week were more centered within these boxes versus at the top. I understand them being at the top because they give more room for anything you might want to add in, but it's not my favorite um, placement of them. Okay, now we are going to categorize these. So I'm just turning to look at the categories that I used last week. Of course, ugh, my planner was far away from me. And we are going to do... Um, personal and this is going to be things like uh, a chiropractor appointment, my niece and nephew's schedules, just things that aren't related to other categories, not other categories. I mean, these are the things that I, I'm, I'm just categorizing as personal. Then we have home. Home is going to be packing and moving. Then we have PWI for plan with the lease. This is where I'll track things I need to film, any releases or sales that happen. This is for Patreon. And this week, this one is going to be for finance because this is probably the biggest financial week of, well, not probably, this is the biggest financial week of my entire life. When I was saying probably, I was thinking it might be the biggest financial week of my whole life after this. I was thinking just at this far. I'm not, my words aren't working. Sorry. Okay. Now I forgot last week to fix the month so we are going to put June there and then I can move this over. I did put down on a sticky note which I now can't find of course. Oh here we go. <laughs> my niece and nephew or my um I think it's all my nephew's sports actually. I think my niece is finished with her spring sports so not everything that they have I'm going to be going to this week. I have to allow myself some time to focus this one week on the things that I need to handle. So I think that over here we're just going to put weekend because a lot of plan my plan with Elise work is really not going to happen this weekend because I am going to be at a new house painting and prepping and all that. So first up, let's take some of these finance stickers because this week, I'm just looking at bills, 15th and 17th. I have two bills due, 15 and 17. So those are gonna go down there. And I'm going to write, what are the bills? Geico. And I'll check it off once it's paid. And cap one, which is one of my credit cards. And I'll check that off once it's paid as well. Then home, we're going to put, I think this yellow sticker here. And I wanted to see if there'd be any sort of like celebratory icon. I think what we're going to do is take a couple of these stars. Let's put one in the middle. I know that these are probably intended for bullets, but instead we're going we're gonna to put them here um, and write closing day. And then I know I'm kind of all over the place. I'm just sort of listing things out as I know that they're happening. So then we're going to take this one on Tuesday. I have a Patreon Zoom at 7 p.m.
I have my other book of planner Kate stickers, but because this is a kit, I'm just going to first try to use everything that, um, any, anything I can from here, and then we'll see what else needs to be sort of filled in. So, um, I don't know if I'm really going to use any of these. I mean, clean house is kind of what I'm dealing with <laughs> on a daily basis. So I can put payday up here because Monday is payday. Also, you know what? Friday is payday. So I'm paid on Mondays until, unless there's a holiday on a Monday. And in that case, payday comes through on the Friday before. So I already used that payday. I'm sure I have another one in here somewhere. Oh wait, you know what? While we have the watch sticker, let's find one that matches this spread. I did this last week, I'm doing it again. <laughs> On Wednesday, there will be a new episode of Real Housewives in New Jersey. That reunion is insane, if anyone here watches. <laughs> um, appointment sticker. Let's take one of these out. Because I have an appointment on Monday on my lunch break and that is with the chiropractor just to deal with some neck pain that I've been having I think it's at 1 30 but I have to double check so I'm not going to write the time yet I was still looking for payday stickers I know I have them budget expenses balance bills read Hmm. Maybe they're in my other thing of Planner Kate stickers, which of course is packed. So I thought I saw another one, even though it was just a different font. Let's just double check. Yeah, this one. I don't care that much that it's another font. Sometimes you just got to plan what you can, right? So Friday is also going to be payday. Now, before I forget, try to get that back in. I need to, are we still like somewhat visible on camera? Yeah, maybe a little crooked. I don't know, whoops, I think I just made it worse. Well, let's fix that. <laughs> this is just where I'm at in life right now. Um, Friday, Thursday, not Friday, Thursday. That's another yellow, let's take this. I need to go to the bank, that's probably gonna be finance because I need to get um, the check certified, cashier's check, whatever it's called, because you can't just like go to a closing with a check apparently. So I <laughs> need to get that check on Thursday. I don't think I'll have the final amount that I'm gonna owe until Thursday. So that has to happen. Um, then the other thing is I'm like looking to see what else I can use here in terms of what I know is happening this week. Oh, kids sports. Right. I forgot about that. So let's grab maybe these. Um, and I have to be intentional about my time. So we'll see. I'm going to do uh, 530. I have to write small there. Baseball. Not sure I'm going to make it to that one. Um, 614, Ugh, I hate the time of this game, but it's my nephew's last soccer game and it's at eight o'clock at night. And I just hate the time of it because I go to sleep early. I am usually in bed by eight. The game will be like eight to nine 30 and I live a half hour away. So not ideal. If it weren't the last game of the season, I definitely wouldn't be going, but, um, it's the last game of the season. Then on the 16th, which I don't also don't know that I'll go to because it's my closing day, there is a baseball game at 6. There's also a baseball tournament all day on Saturday. That is a definite no from me, but there's a game on Sunday that's a possibility. It depends on how far I get on Saturday because Saturday I'm going to be painting two of the rooms in the house. That is at 930 
baseball because maybe I'll just go to the baseball game and then come back and paint. Um, so I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I like to have it all in my planner, even if it's not confirmed that I'm going to be doing it all. Like just want to know what the options are going to be, um, or where I might want to go. Okay. <sighs> Finance payday. We've got the bills. Patreon. I put the zoom in the wrong place. <laughs> so this is going to go here. Plan with Elise is very much, a lot of things are up in the air right now. Um, there is a wrong, wrong release on Thursday. So that can go over here. And then that's probably it for Plan with Elise in terms of what I can put down in advance. Home is just going to be packing. So I've broken down my packing into goals like uh, each week. So let me see what this week is going to be. I haven't actually looked at it yet because it's not this week yet when I'm filming this. So we need to find that. My entire desk is covered in stuff. So I have to f figure out what that goal is. I, have to, it's, I just opened my planner. It's not in my goal planner, which is a little bit of a problem. Um, but I have been on track. So my goal in for last week was my office, um, which is almost finished. Really what's left in my office are the things that I need. So as each day goes on, I will decide on what exactly I'm going to do. Okay, while I still can't find my June goals pages, I just opened my YouTube video and I see that for the week of the 12th, my goal is to buy paint. I actually already did that. Um, oh wait, that's the wrong week. I messed up. No, I didn't really mess up. Okay, so what I had written in my goal planner was buy paint, paint bedroom and office, pack rest of office. I can paint the bedroom and office, but not until after Friday when I close. So the idea is pack the rest of the office. So. Um, there's also more than just the office that needs to be packed. Like today is Saturday. I packed as much in my bathroom as I could. But as I'm walking around my apartment, I'm like, oh, these picture frames can be packed, this and that. So home is really just going to be a lot of random things that I'm going to have myself pack. Um, and that is going to be each day through Thursday. What I also need to add to my list Thursday, and this is going to be personal, is because that I think that's really categorized as a personal item, but clean out car. I don't have that much in my car, but as an aunt who goes to a lot of sports games, my the back of my car has two big chairs, a couple blankets. Um, so just things like that. I think there might even be a pair of high heels in my trunk from somewhere where I wore, wore high heels and didn't want to drive home in them and they're in my trunk. So I want to clean out my car so that I can um, flatten, you know, my seats go down and all of that. What I probably am going to do is on Friday after I close, I'm going to go to the house and maybe put some of the things in the garage I've never had a garage to myself before, so I'll do that and that'll help because I don't want to like take the chairs out and put them in my apartment and then have to move them again. So they may stay in there except for just like the high heels and things like that. And then Friday, I can put them in the trunk or not the trunk, the garage of the house. All right. I think the rest of this might just be like really rambly. So I'm going to use my Zig Clean Color Dot for my bullets, but I sort of just kind of wanted to like walk through what this week is going to look like and get things set up for myself in terms of priorities. And we are in the final stretch. It's almost here. So thanks for your support. And we're, let's write Real Housewives. Planner Kate stickers, code at least 20 will give you a discount. I'll link these below in case you're interested. I really like the ice creams here. I think that there's enough left because of the layout that I use that I can definitely do like a vertical spread with these or something. I think that, um, that they'll be fun. So, oh, I could have used that little TV icon, but it's okay. We've got the same one here. So I think we're going to leave it, leave it at that. 
I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for hanging out with me. Stay tuned to my channel this week for other videos, even though we may be off schedule. Um, make sure you're subscribed and you have your notification bell turned on so that you are notified because of me being off schedule. That is a wrap. Thanks again. I'll see you soon.